talking about the best Android smartwatch available in the market that's operated by Wear OS, you would certainly go for the Galaxy Watch 5 from Samsung or arguably the new Pixel Watch. However, the Watch 5 features a sleek design along with all the adequate sensors you might think of. But yet, I would prefer my Galaxy Watch 4 Classic over the Watch 5. So for those who own a Galaxy Watch 4 and are thinking about whether you should upgrade or not, here's our video on the mind-blowing features of the Samsung Galaxy Watch 4 that might make you consider before upgrading to the next watch. So with that being said, let's jump in. So the very first feature that sets the Watch 4 Classic apart from the Watch 5 is its design with its unique rotating bezel. This classic design with a touch of modern elegance surely deserves some appreciation. Sacrificing such a premium feature only for the touch bezel doesn't seem to be worth it. Besides, to make it even more jaw-dropping, the watch lets you use customized watch faces to match your style. And combining it with a stainless steel strap, I can use my watch 4 as a traditional classic watch, which perhaps isn't possible with the watch 5. The very next useful feature that makes me want to stick to my Watch 4 is voice assistance. Both the Galaxy Watch 4 and 5 comes with improved AI recognition to understand words and respond quite accurately. For instance, you can ask your Galaxy Watch 4 to start a 100-meter running exercise and it would start tracking your calories instantly. You won't find any extra advantages on the Watch 5 with voice assistance. But even with all these exercise modes, how would you know if you're able to improve your fitness or not? That's where the health sensor kicks in. With the latest Watch 5, you get a new sensor for measuring skin temperature. But that is only for ensuring a bit more accurate female menstrual tracking, not for measuring skin temperature. And the rest of the sensors are similar to the Watch 4, so there's no point in upgrading even if you're more health conscious. Another convenient feature that I like most about the Watch 4 is instant messaging. Suppose you're on the go or stuck in a crowded place. You might not feel like pulling out your smartphone from your pocket. Instead, you can use your Watch 4 for replying to important texts. You can find the G board from the Play Store, which will allow you to doodle on your watch, and it will transform into texts. You can also use speech-to-text feature that will transform your words into texts as well. But with Watch 5, the screen size is slightly reduced compared to the Watch 4 Classic, so you get less space for typing. Talking about display, the Galaxy Watch 5 does offer sapphire glass for enhanced protection, but the Corning Gorilla Glass from Watch 4 Classic also does a great job in protecting your smartwatch. As for other features, both the watches come with easy intuitive music control, smartphone tracking feature right from your wrist, and hands-free usage while doing workouts. Overall, you get pretty much similar features in both the Galaxy Watch 4 and 5, except for the sapphire glass and a skin temperature sensor, which is also limited. Besides, even if I trade in my Galaxy Watch 4 Classic for the Watch 5, I have to pay extra bucks. And for such a minimal upgrade, I don't find it a worthy upgrade. Anyway, that's all from my point of view that's stopping me from upgrading to the Watch 5. But what are your thoughts on it? Do you find the Galaxy Watch a worthy upgrade?